dear people, we salute you. We want to congratulate you for your steadfastness in observing the strike and the ghost towns declared by the consortium, even from the diaspora. We want to particularly thank you for ignoring the ignoble strike suspension that was done by our brothers out of pressure and all manner of intimidation and cohesion from the high hands of this regime. By keeping your children home on Monday and throughout the week, and by making sure that it, our towns and villages were dead, we have succeeded once more to speak clearly to Yaoundé about what we want. I want to beg you from the very bottom of our hearts, the hearts of the leadership of this struggle, that we should all forgive our brothers who erred in suspending this, this strike, in, in attempting to suspend the strike. It is part of our culture to forgive. Let us remain true to our culture and forgive them wholeheartedly, protect and guard them. Also, we want to appeal that Friday the 10th and Saturday the 11th should see the kind of ghost that we have not seen since history happen in Anglophone Cameroon and in this country. We must make sure that even birds are not seen on the streets on Friday and on Saturday. Needless to remind you that our brothers in Francophone Cameroon know, because they have been taught and told, that the 11th of February is the date that French Cameroon annexed English Cameroon. In other words, it is the official date of our servitude. Therefore, we must boycott the 11th of February because if we allow our children and ourselves to celebrate this date, to commemorate this date, then we have affirmed to the authorities in Yaoundé and to the whole world that we are happy with our status. Slavehood. Dear people, we want to appeal for your understanding and steadfastness once more. And we finally want to appreciate our foreign host for enabling me to communicate to you people. They have given me freedom of communication and we shall be coming to you through text messages, sign messages, videos like this one to tell us the way forward and what conduct or behavior to uphold during this struggle. Therefore, having secured my liberty to communicate, I am now officially back on the consortium team. We want to thank our brothers Mark and Ivor and all the other people who have collaborated with them for the wonderful and marvelous job they have done. And we pray that now that I am back in the house, and in the house I mean the consortium, things shall move a lot faster and in the days ahead, we shall be communicating more after we would have done the evaluation of what would have happened on the 11th of February. We encourage you for your steadfastness, knowing that God is in charge. May he bless you, may he protect you, and protect us, protect our people, our children, until the day of victory.